All right, nice. Let's see what's in this. Hold on one second. Oh yeah, that looks awesome. Nice, looks awesome, love it, love it. Hey guys, what's going on? So, uh, what do you guys think of the shirt? It was just a little shirt idea I had. Uh, I just wanted to test out uh, a store. I just wanted to see how the quality was and See if I might uh, put my hand in making some shirts. Anyways, uh, what I want to talk to you guys today is uh, my next modification. And I'm really talking about big modification. And what I have thought of is doing uh, something along the lines of the intake. So. I really, really, really want to do the uh, camshaft, but every time I go through and look at it and then do my research for my next mods after that, it would just be much better for me to wait to do the camshaft, because the next mod I'm planning on doing is an intake manifold. So I don't know if I'm going to do a ported intake or if I'm going to do the Edelbrock Vector 2 or Victor 2. What I was thinking along the lines of that was if I do the Edelbrock, I want to do a Pro Charger just to see how the uh, intake manifold and the uh, Pro Charger would work together. I think it would be a good pair, but uh, that means I could also do a higher uh, PSI so I'll probably end up going that route instead of doing the ported 5.7 intake I'll probably do the Elder Brock uh, intake and then after that I'll probably end up doing heads and after the heads I would do the camshaft or even if I have enough money to drop all at once I'd probably do the heads and the camshaft at the same time but we're talking major coin for both of those being done not just in parts, but in labor as well, because it's, it, the, the camshaft alone is probably going to be about $1,900 in labor. I'm not going to do that myself. I don't trust myself doing it because I've never done it before. I would like to do it myself, but there's, it's so detailed that I don't think I could get everything with me being a novice at it. So my thought is to have someone install it along with the heads. And the heads are gonna be about 1500 bucks in parts alone. So while you're doing the camshaft, might as well do the heads because you have to take the heads off anyway. But uh, yeah, so guys, that's the next couple mods I have in mind. I'm gonna do the uh, intake first, and then I'm going to do the do the heads and then do the camshaft and then later down the road probably do force induction but anyways guys be sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next one